So it's day two and today we're going to do a little more proactive outreach stuff. I got this sign that says fuck your badge and on the other side it says you do not need a badge to protect people, you do need one to protect the government. And so basically going to walk around and uh, hold our sign, maybe get a few photo ops with some cops and see how it goes. So come along, RNC day two. Everyone's rocking the cop lock gear. I got my fuck the police shirt on. Josh is wearing the film the police. Kelly's got his Nevada cop lock shirt on. And uh, you can get all those over at coplock.org slash store. This square is just like a lock up. How's it going guys? Pretty good. Can I talk to you about your signs? Sure. Alright, how's it going? So uh, what is coplock.org uh, trying, trying to achieve right now? Well, coplock.org is a website that advocates badges go for extra rights, but I myself am out here trying to relay a message that a badge and a uniform and a service provided by a monopoly of, known as the government uh, is not needed to actually protect people. It's a service of protection, it's just that, a service. And right now the government has a monopoly on that service and that's why we have so many disagreements here in the United States about what policing should be. So, um, do you, in what way do we keep order if not the police? Well, that's up to everyone else on the side. I believe that you as an individual should have the right, uh, just as you do where to eat and what you want to eat, as you should with uh, protection. You should uh -huh. just use what means you want to protect you. And if that's hiring people to protect you, so be it. Maybe you want to use a video camera to secure your property, or maybe you want to use uh, weapons as, as deterrents. Uh, all those choices, if you're free, should be yours to make. But what about the weaker people who aren't able to protect themselves uh, physically? Well, then they might become uh, more communal and have, like, uh, you know, uh, watchdog groups, uh, neighborhood watches. They would co communicate through ostracism, possibly. Again, I don't have all the answers. All I know is that the government doesn't have the one-size-fits-all answer for us either. Right. There's two sides, though. Can I take a picture of this side, too? Too many words? Got to read both sides. You're shitting me, right? Nope. Should we should have a choice. You got to eat jumbos and you had that choice. Shouldn't I have to choose? Shouldn't I say, do we decide we should have a choice? Why don't you speak simply and people I am, sir. You do not need a badge to protect people. You do need one to protect the government. That's how I feel it works. We are a nation of law or we're a nation of anarchists. If we're a nation of anarchists, I'm going to win. Don't ever forget that. Well, that's how you feel, but I disagree. When you're getting kicked in the head on the ground, your mom? No. That's Only because that's how it works these days. I would rather have the means to protect myself. I don't hate them either. I want them to take my money voluntarily. I hope they provide me a service directly. Hi, can we talk to you? Sure. We're with KFI Radio in Los Angeles, California. What is your take on the police and police shootings in Louisiana and Texas? It's my same as there is for all the police shootings at the hands of police. Uh, that the loss of life is absolutely tragic and that many civilians have been having the conversation of what do we do now that our people are dying. And I'm very, I'm very saddened that the police have to join us in this conversation now. But I hope that they come to logical conclusions. So you equate like, because those were executions. You think the police were executing civilians? Mm -hmm. I, I think everybody is murdering each other. And that's unfortunate. And I think we have to look at why are we doing it. And like the chief of Dallas said, the police are being asked to do too much. That is a position I agree with. When you, when the police are being asked to go to the neighbor's house to tap someone to turn down their music, and then all of a sudden they answer the door with a screwdriver, the officer thinks it's a gun, and we have a murder again. And then you have rides in the street, but we're not really talking about the issue. Why are police answering those calls? Why are police interacting between voluntary, peaceful interactions? This is a distrust with the police. You guys say, you don't need a badge to provide the service of protection and do it directly to the customer. You don't need the uh, government giving you guys all that bullshit. You too, sir. Please put down your badge and provide the service directly to the consumer. Oh, it's this guy. That would be preferable. Come on, man. Then when we don't want to pay for bad cops, we don't have to. Come on. Just stop paying for them. You're going 
down to their level with that sign. We do but need some. I do not need a badge. But you do need protection. Read other, the sign. But the other All right. That, that's, that's what the cops hard. should be saying. That's, that's a little hard. If they really want to provide a good services protection, then they should say fuck their badge. I, I'm just saying, as someone who loves our American democracy, I think that's a little harsh language. I think it, I, I agree. I know. I it's, agree. Harsh, it's harsh language. I Being agree. Cleveland are better than the Killing people language. is harsh. Caging them is harsh. Better. Taking money from people. Right. Grow up. Better. Let me choose my own form of protection. That's what I want. I know. I don't have a job. Somehow I existed for 34 years on the planet without having a job. I know. I know. Those are great rebuttals. You sound really intelligent. I know I'm fine. I can end my own. I, I can I can have a logical conversation with the things I want. You're just like, loser, get a job. Right. Reproofs of instruction are the way of life. When you roam, they will keep you. When you lie down, they will speak to you. Why would you even get up in a here? You That's a ten dollar sign. That looks like like a I don't want the police to help. We can handle our disputes ourselves. All I'm saying is, I support our police. Okay, there are some bad police officers, but you don't need to go tell them to go fuck themselves because when our police fall, our country fall. Okay, we need our police, and we got to support them. That's your suggestion. We need to put the bad police in jail and support the rest of the 99.9 percent of them. But you can't. You can't hold the police in jail. You can't. You can't withdraw your funding from them. That's what I want. I want the option to choose the police I pay for. You force me. Well, we said that they stopped the government from forcing us to pay for them. You and I are not against, are against each other. We're on the same side. In fact, me and those police aren't against each other. We're also on the same side. I'm sick of seeing people die because the police kill them or people want to kill police because of what they do. I want to choose the protection I serve or that I want. You should have the freedom to choose the protection you want. These officers should offer us a service directly. The government forces us to do what we, I want options. I want freedom. And I'd really like you to pay me for my sign that you made whole. That you your choice. Yes, I'd really like you to pay me for my sign that you made whole. That you your choice. Yes, I am an anarchist. Other problems. Right? The the world 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 we're now we're standing in a public street. And so if you don't like what you're doing, you're doing in this public street, you can make all your pants and all your all your. I wouldn't come to your house. I wouldn't come to your house. I wouldn't come to your house. I'm just saying. You can't say fuck your life. You can't. But I'm against it. Conscious women. 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 Conscious